Hello, my name is Patricia Grootjans. I live in the Netherlands and I'm a quantum healer trained by Dolores Cannon and uh, Ken Scroll Goldman. And I've also developed my own method in quantum healing. And this is a method that I combine with astrology as I'm also an, an astrologer. And um, today we are talking about uh, the theme of power, truth, integrity. And these are themes that we all have to deal with, and especially the last few years. I think for many people, these issues have been triggered. Like, where is my personal power? <clears throat> where is the collective power? What is the truth? And what is fake? What is integrity? And whose integrity do I follow? Do I follow my own wisdom? Or do I follow the wisdom of an external authority. Now, and as an astrologer, I always like to look at things from um, the um, planetary cosmic perspective. And power has got to do with Pluto. The Pluto that looks underneath the surface. Like, okay, what is happening underneath the surface? And how is power being divided? How are we able to make our own choices? How is it with our will, our free will? And when we are looking at truth, we are looking at Jupiter in the chart. Jupiter holds our inner wisdom. And Jupiter can be seen as our higher wisdom. It's also the planet that reigns um, themes about um, confidence, faith, trust, but especially trusting your own inner wisdom. And then integrity has got to do with Saturn, like being honest. And um, I think what all of these planets have in common is uh, that it takes courage to stand in your own power and to follow your inner wisdom. It takes courage to stay true to your own integrity. Now, it is interesting that um, in December 2019, we had these three planets uh, aligned with each other, Pluto, Jupiter and Saturn. And it was the beginning of uh, a pandemic, of course, but it was also the beginning of a whole uh, process of collective awakening. And where are we now in this process of awakening? I think if we want to look at the collective process, we need to know who we are as an individual. We need to know uh, how we are dealing with our own power, our own courage, our own integrity, our own truth. Now, of course, when uh, reading a birth chart, it's always interesting to look at the chart and to see um, how the planets are behaving. But there are merely tools and um, what is so fascinating when you start combining this with uh, quantum healing, you know that you can uh, connect with these uh, planetary energies, these cosmic energies, when you bring yourself in a meditative state, or as we like to call it in quantum healing, the theta state. Now, um, I would like to invite you to connect with your Jupiter, your planet of trust your energy of um, the inner wisdom, the inner truth. And it is also the planet that ha holds the optimism. And um, so if you would like to connect with your Jupiter, how can you do that? Well, bring yourself in a relaxed state by focus on your breathing for a while. And then ask yourself, who is my inner teacher? Who is my inner wisdom? What name would I like to give to my inner teacher? And if you would like to join me, just do that right now. Just take a few breaths. Just breathe in and breathe out. And ask yourself, who is my inner teacher? my inner wisdom and maybe you can hear a name or you think of an image 
And I would like you to write that down. Write down the name of your inner teacher, your inner wisdom. And now I would like to ask you to um, do a similar thing by asking your inner teacher, what symbol does it hold for you? With which symbol can you connect with your inner teacher? So just take a few moments to connect with your inner wisdom, your higher wisdom, and ask if it has a symbol for you, a symbol that can help you to connect with your inner teacher, your inner wisdom, your trust, your optimism. So if you have seen an image of a symbol, or maybe you've heard a word uh, of a symbol, just write it down. And then I would like to ask you to do the same thing and ask your inner teacher, what is the color that belongs to your inner teacher? And which sound does it have? Is it related to a specific song? And just take your time to allow the melodies of the sounds to enter your mind, enter your consciousness. So now we have the color, a symbol, maybe a sound. And then I would like to ask you to do the same and ask your inner teacher, which crystal uh, reflects the energy of your inner wisdom. Just take a few breaths and focus on your inner teacher and allow the image of a crystal to come up and see which crystal this is. And just write down the name of this crystal. And you could also place this crystal somewhere on your body or your energetical body where you feel that this energy is needed. Now maybe this is the heart or the third eye or the crown, maybe your tummy. Just take a few moments to see where this crystal is needed, where the energy of your inner wisdom is needed. Wonderful. So in a few minutes, you've already gained a lot of information about your inner teacher, your inner wisdom. And I would like to call my inner teacher the higher self. And this is, of course, the energy uh, that we work with within quantum healing. And the higher self is not an external authority. It is our inner authority. So whenever we feel uh, fear or doubts or we feel uh, upset by things that are happening in the world, just take a few minutes, focus on your breathing and connect with your inner wisdom, your inner teacher that, we, that I would like to call the higher self. And maybe you uh, have a different name for it. And with all the uh, symbols that we have found, uh, in these few minutes, you could also make uh, like a vision board with these symbols and these colors, or maybe you would like to make a seasonal table with these objects. Everything to remind you of your inner strength, your inner power. And I would like you to remember that whenever you are in a situation that causes fear, just focus on your breathing for a little while Make sure that the out-breath is longer than the in-breath and connect with your inner wisdom because when you know who you are, when you know your inner wisdom, you're always aligned with your truth, your power and your integrity. So thank you for listening and um, if you would like to find more information about um, my books, my courses, uh, then uh, I would like to ask you to visit my website www.patriciagrootjans.com 
And here you can find um, my videos, my interviews, the books that I've published, and also the courses that I, that I have published on Udemy. So thank you and um, see you next time.